The one thing I'm watching this week is the internet space. There are a number of companies reporting earnings. First off, looking at Grubhub, which reports on May 1st. But ahead of earnings, what we're looking at from the options perspective is the implied move is around 11%. And that's below what we typically see. So the market isn't pricing in as much risk or as much craziness as we've seen in terms of moves over the past four quarters here. Looking at what that actual sentiment is, it definitely seems to be a bit more cautious. Another name that we're looking at for this week is Snapchat. Just look into the options in terms of what's being priced in. The market's pricing in roughly a 15% move around earnings. This is a pretty interesting one as this is well off what we've seen Snap move following earnings reports over the last four quarters, which has been closer to 24%. So just from an options perspective there, the market's not pricing in increased risk relative to what the company's moved over the last four quarters. In terms of the sentiment, we've definitely started to see some investors get concerned. They're buying some protective puts here. Lastly, Spotify is reporting earnings this week. It's interesting about Spotify. This is the first time the company is reporting earnings where we can use the options following its IPO. The implied move is around 8%, just trying to get a sense of what the risk is that's being priced into the market. For Trading Nation, this is Stacy Gilbert from Susquehanna Financial Group. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.